Families across the county are set to shell out more for their council tax, but will see more police officers on their streets. At a meeting today, Kent Crime Commissioner Matthew Scott got the green light to increase police tax in order to recruit 200 more officers next year. It represents one of the biggest recruitment drives in recent years, but it will cost taxpayers an extra £1 a month. We spoke to Matthew Scott back when it was announced. Today's announcement is possibly one of the biggest recruitment drives uh, for Kent Police in a considerable amount of time. It will mean 200 more police officers, that's in addition to the ones that we already have, uh, and they will be focused on local policing, rural policing, uh, making sure that people are safe on our roads, and lots of different areas where uh, people have said they want to see uh, action from their police force. Despite having more police on the streets, Malcolm Upton doesn't think enough is being done for communities. At the moment, with the way the police are at the moment, we have to wait ages for a 999 call. If they decide to put it up, which they are doing, then I don't think more police officers in the area is going to make any difference whatsoever because the police aren't doing their job at the moment. So any more police officers, they're just going to be sitting around doing nothing. I think at the end of the day, they've got to start looking at their own services within the actual constabulary. Um, if they start looking at points of view from residents and asking their views, the views that they'll be given is that they're not doing their job, they're missing out on 999 calls, they need to look at the 101 calls as well because you wait an hour and a half on there. So even with more police officers it's not going to change and I can't see why we should not have the council tax reduced because they're not doing their job or take them out of the services and let the government deal with it. Apart from this £1 rise, KCC has recently announced that council tax will go up by 5% this year. Caroline Clark from the Diocese of Rochester has been handing out flyers to try and stop people from turning to loan sharks and payday loans to help pay their bills. I think that people who don't budget could be on a very short wicket. You know, it, it, you really these days, because everything has, everything's gone up in price and things happen unexpectedly, we all need to be good at budgeting and we all need to be watching what's being spent and how. This year, the average bill for police tax was just over £157. This will rise to £169.15 in the year 2018 to 2019. This is Poppy Jeffrey for KMTV.